Hello everybody, Buddy Caboosey's here, and today I'm going to show you how to make a 2D intro on Sony Vegas. Um, nothing else, no magic bullet or after effects or anything like that. Uh, like, no add-on, just what it comes with. So, you're going to need four video tracks. Well, you don't need them, but I need them for what I'm going to make. And, um, so... You're gonna need a uh, image on what you want. I'm gonna use Pikachu, but um, you can use whatever. So the first step, you go to the bottom layer, then go to Media Generators and make a white uh, backdrop, which it did this already. So I'll try again. You could probably hear South Park in the background. That's my friend. Hi. He says hi. <laughs> um, and then the second part, you're gonna go import your Pikachu or um, whatever you picked. There's Pikachu. Let's add Pikachu in there. Okay. Then you click on this. Um, I don't know. Uh, track motion, and then. Make it smaller to where you want. And then crop it to the left or right. Whatever. I like the left better. Maybe a little bit. Yeah, there we go. Alright, um. Then you're gonna right click and insert text media. And then, um. Let's see, I don't know what to write or type. Put it to black so you can see. Alec, what should I write? Huh? Never mind. I was out. Write Alec. Okay. And uh, I like, I'm not sure what it's called. Nero Pole. I think that's what it's called. Yeah. Nero Pole. Um, just put that to the side for a second. So, um, the last thing I like to do. Oh shoot. Is insert text media again. Change the size to like 18 ish. Just really small. And then type in your YouTube channel. YouTube.com slash mine is Buddy Kabusi. Pretty sure I selected. Yeah, there we go. Alright. So, then you crop it to where you want. And uh, then that's where you get this one. Um, I'm going to make it bigger just so it looks more clean. Like that. So, there is um, basic. But then, um, I like to do this for effect. Go to Media Generators, Color Gradient, and uh, Elliptical Transparent to Black. Then click this number 2 right here and stretch it to the corner. So, look on uh, the screen. If you go like this, it changes the shape, shape. But just pull it to the corner. And then you can make it whatever color and then use the transparency thingy <laughs> um, but I like black and white and then a little like that so that is basically it but um, also I like to go to um, color corrector add it to the top layer and then kind of find a color you want um, I like this you can't really you can't see these at all so you don't need to worry about that um, color curves you can do that too me I don't think I used it yeah so like that and then uh, take a snapshot and then 
save it to um your uh thingy my bobber your photos and I'm actually going to stop there for a second and change something. Alright, so I'm back. Uh I just changed the YouTube username to something else. <sighs> so, um, yeah, save a snapshot. I'll just call it poop, because I'm immature. And, uh, just make a new one. Don't save it. I mean, you can, but you don't really need to. So then, import your picture. Drag it. Extend it, I think, five seconds is perfect these aren't really meant to be long intros um, then you go to the pan crop button right here and there's these little lines that indicate um, like a keyframe but first what you want to do is you're gonna want to shrink it just barely I already have a saved one yeah so right there and then each keyframe, you just barely move it. I mean, like, barely. Microscopically, even. And just keep doing it to the very end. And almost done. And then go to the restore or your preset whatever and it should look like this you see how it's like bare or uh, like wiggling and that is your intro so um i hope you guys enjoyed leave a like if you desire um i love you bye